Okay, so I am about to film my February favorites, so you're going to see this again probably tomorrow. <laughs> um, but before I do that, I wanted to give you guys a quick little intro to the video that I'm showing right now because it is a bonus for this week. I know a lot of you really enjoyed the get ready with me that I did. One of my first videos, actually the first video on this channel. So that seemed to be a pretty decent hit and I decided I'd do that again. I did go to a wedding this past weekend with Josh, so I got ready for that and just kind of let you guys take along for that. So it's pretty much just me getting ready. I hope you guys enjoy this and I'll see you tomorrow for some February favorites. Get ready with you. Um, I did put my foundation on already so that I have that done, but I just kind of threw my hair messy for now because I'm planning to do kind of a half up look. So to make sure that my makeup is actually on my face evenly and not hidden by hair, I threw it up for now. But that's what I've got going on. I also just have like a sweatshirt on for now so that I can take that off without messing things up later. And I think without further ado, I'm gonna go ahead and start with like bronzer, a little bit of blush, some contour. Probably put the eyes on next and then maybe add more blush depending on what we need. I am doing kind of a burgundy look today. So we'll start with that, we'll finish up the base face though. And for that, I'm just using the Physicians Formula All-Star Palette, which smells amazing. Like, I don't know. <laughs> like the smell of it but anyway so that's what I'm starting with and again like the last time I did my mirrors like here right next to you guys so if you see me kind of looking that way that's why um is my mirrors over here you guys are over here it's just the way this room is set up so I'm gonna go ahead and put this on and touch base in a minute Because I don't like really sharp lines, I do come back with my fluffy brush and a little bit of my fingers usually to kind of try and meld it in so it looks more natural. We don't have like sharpness going on. Which in the camera it looks like there's a blotch here, but in the mirror there's not. So I'm not sure what's going on there. <laughs> but yeah, so that's why I have this is I just kind of like to meld it a little bit more. So that's kind of the base of my face. We got some bronzing. I mean, decently tan person. Oh, my Atlanta, my, this light, the way I have my light right now makes my face look way tan on my neck. I promise you it's not. It's just the shadowing. It is actually even, I'm gonna blend down my neck a little more cause there's a little bit of differentiation here. Um, because usually I get really tan in the summer and the powder that I use is still my like medium. I kind of use that one year round and then just blend it through. So I'm gonna go back and do that and they'll just nice. All right, so for eyes, I'm starting with my um, Pure Base Top Coat Copper color. So I'm gonna start with that. And again, if you weren't here last time, it's got this weird like silicone applicator, right? Ooh, where are my, hello, there it is. Um, so that's what this thing is. And it just kind of helps to get through this mesh layer.
Okay, this is the necklace, just so you guys have reference, kind of what's happening. So we're kind of, kind of matching it, is kind of the goal. Um, so I do have some vibrant burgundy on, but I also don't want to be over the top. So we're not going all the way up, we're doing neutrals up top. We're going to start with that. I may add more later, I may add glitter. I like glitter. But we're going to start with this, and I'm going to go ahead and put on brows and eyeliner and see how that looks and then I have some more blush that I'm gonna put on because there's not really a lot that one that I put on is really light for me but I have my lovely Clinique um this was a limited edition that happened around um Black Friday so I'm gonna use these colors though so. all right this one eyeliner I have to move into my mirror so I'm gonna jump through this right now um, it's a new eyeliner, so it's like really precise still. I just got it. It's also a physician formula. I'm trying this one out. So I'm going to stop you guys, and then I'll come back once I have my eyeliner and mascara on, which my mascara, I'm doing the, um, that one from Too Faced. That's the mascara that I'm using. And then I have a brow pencil from Benefit that I'm trying right now as well. So I'm going to go ahead and just put those on. Um, I can do my brow pencil with you guys first, actually, and then I'll put the other two on. But this is, this one's easy enough to draw in while I chit-chat. It's not a lot, like, you can't tell a lot, but on this eye, I have this scar here. So sometimes I like to put it in just to balance it out and kind of even up that scarring a little so it's a little less noticeable through the eyebrow there. Since hair won't grow there. Because it's a scar. <laughs> If you're wondering, I ran into a wall when I was a small child. Like, not super small, like 8 or 10 or something. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm going to put on the eyeliner and I'll be back. Okay. So I have eyeliner on now. I have mascara on. It does help to bring it together a little bit. Um, But I want more. Shimmer. <laughs> <laughs> because I like shimmer. So I'm going to do... Uh, i got to figure out which brush I want. No... This one's all pink now, um, but it's not coming off my hand. So we're going to use this one and then I'm going to wash this brush afterwards. So I'm going to go back into the uh, natural nudes with the sparkling sand because it's got a little bit of pinkish. But this is going in the inner corner, so I want something more neutral. Let's go on the lighter side. A little bit shimmery. Blend it across. Okay. That makes me happy. I like a little shimmer. Okay, that looks better. I think I'm liking that. Let me see. I don't know where I put my earrings. They're somewhere next to me. I lost them. There they are. All right, so let's just, yeah, that's a good look. I will, I'm gonna curl my hair and then I'll come back to you guys. I'm gonna quickly hop back on now that I'm ready. I did put some lips on as you can see. I added a little bit more blush, that middle Clinique one to match everything. And then I've got my jewelry on and I'm dressed and ready to go. Um, let me see, I'm gonna set you guys down in a second and give you a full view or I'll post, I'll probably put a picture in um, of me at the wedding maybe in everything, um, in my dress and everything. I got this dress super cute uh, recently from the Madison and Mallory boutique. It's an online thing, but I've also got my purse. That's a part of our online extras from 31. I'm gonna hold you out, I'm holding you guys, so it's a little weird angle, I know. But I love this one with this chain. It is an online extra, and there's also a black satin one if you don't like the berry and the sequins. But I love this one, it's just a fold over. It's nice and classy and ready to go. So I'm ready for the wedding, which is going to be super fun. I'm going to show you what kind of we got them for their gift since this will be up after the wedding. So let's just kind of come down here. This is what I do for gifts a lot. Um, I love to do this for wedding gifts. It's our picnic thermal. And then we put inside the stuff from the registry, 
but the picnic thermal makes a great bag and they can use it again later and it also went along with the theme of what we got them so that's everything i will talk to you guys later um if you enjoy these types of videos please subscribe and give it a thumbs up so i know see you later